Hello everyone and welcome to US Computer Solutions for another how-to tutorial. Now assuming you have the drivers installed for this Wi-Fi adapter, we're going to go to Server Manager. Alright, after it loads, let's go to Add Roles and Features. Alright, click Next here. Next again. Over here, choose your server. Of course, an IP address is shown. This is a default Windows IP address. When you're not connected to anything, it just gives a default IP address. Don't worry about it. Click Next. All right. And now we're going to scroll down and make sure that the file and storage services are installed. And then click Next. All right. And then we're going to scroll all the way down and go to Wireless LAN Services check that box over here and then click on next you can restart the computer now if you want it's required but if required install it all right let me fast forward a little bit all right the installation is finished right now let's click on close let's exit out of here all right let's go back to network connection area and let's try and enable wi-fi now it's still not enabling we're going to have to uh, restart the computer from this point. All right, let me restart the computer and get back. At it. All right, now it restarted. Let's go to services over here and let's see what's going on here. WLAN auto config. All right, let's enable this. Right click start service and then click on OK. All right, let's exit out of here. Just refresh. Let's exit out. And now let's go to the wireless connection area. Let's see, nothing is showing yet. It is okay. Let's go to network settings, network and internet. Let's go to ethernet. Let's go change adapter options. And then let's right click on Wi Fi and click enable and see what happens. There you go. Now it got enabled. All right, let's go down here and see if we have any Wi Fi's around us. All right, we can see the Wi Fi. Let's connect to one of them. Let me connect to my Wi-Fi, put my password in. Okay, connecting, connecting, come on, come on. All right, it says connected. Let's test if we can see, if we can browse the internet. Let's minimize everything. Let's go to Internet Explorer. All right, let's go to Dell.com. We're going to start getting annoying pop-ups, but that is okay. Click OK over here. This is a security feature. Just keep adding the websites. It's just a security feature in Internet Explorer. Keep adding. Keep adding for it to open. It's okay. You know, there you have it. Even though I'm just adding and adding and adding so it can unblock all of these websites. Now remember, it's a server computer. It's not made to browse the internet so there you have it guys other than you gotta keep adding if you wanted to browse the internet uh, you can download chrome and it won't do the same thing but please comment subscribe share this video and thank you very much for watching see you again next time